au Cecilia Okesho anayo taarifa hiyo. Baada ya kuhudumu kwa takriban miezi miwili kama mgombea mwenzo mgombea wa gavana wa kaunti ya Nairobi Miguna Miguna, Karen Wanjiko Wangenya ameamua kujiuzulu akikariri uhusiano mbovu kati yake na Miguna. I'm here today to let the public know that I would like to resign from that position. Not that I don't believe in the cause. In fact, I very much believe his ideas are exactly what we need to implement to make Nairobi the green city in the sun once more. Nobody deserves to be pushed around because they have no high level of education. Neither do we need to always attack our opponents and the media to prove our points. Saa chache baadaye Miguna katuma taarifa kwa vyombo vya habari akisisitiza kwamba kisheria hakuna anayeruhusiwa kujiuzulu kwenye kinyang'anyiro baada ya uteuzi na kwamba wakenya watakuwa na fursa ya kuchagua wanayemtaka kama kiongozi wa kaunti ya Nairobi fikapo tarehe ya uchaguzi. Please let it be known that I have nothing against the governor and I wish him the aspiring governor and I wish him well. All I'm saying is we're not compatible and I am not in a position to work with his methods of addressing issues. Sasa hizi tunavyozungumza ni kwamba vijikaratasi vya upiga kura shapigishwa tayari ama zishatengenezwa na sasa hizi tunavyozungumza labda huenda ziko hapo nchini zikiwa na ile picha ya ule mgombea mwenza wake. Kwa hivyo kisheria sioni kama itakuwa jambo rahisi kwenda tena Dubai kule kwa Halgurai kuweka jina ya mgombea mwenza mwingine wa Miguna na kulizileta tena hakuna uwakati. Karen amekuwa mgombea mwenza wa pili kwa Miguna baada ya mgombea wa kitambo James Gadhungu kuamua kugura pasi na sababu kamilifu. Sisi wa kesho Kitchen leo weekend. Eh, mtazamaji, Waswahili wanasema maji ukiyavulia nguo lazima ama sharti uyaoge. Tukiendelea na taarifa zetu pindi tu baada ya uchaguzi mkuu wa Agosti 8 iwapo mkataba wa makubaliano ambao ulifikia